Before the video starts, I'd like to shout out Alex the God for helping me make these types of videos possible. Hello everyone, welcome to a grounded tutorial. Today I will be teaching you guys how to make a pebbled axe, pebbled spear, pebbled hammer, and a spiky sprig. So first of all, for the pebbled spear, we're going to need to pick up some of these sprigs and plant fibers that you can find all around the ground. And also some of these pebbles because we're going to need them to make your weapon sharp and pointy. So when you've collected all of your resources, you're going to head on back to your workbench and then you want to use it and then go down to this tools option. And by the way, I'm in creative with bugs right now, so nothing can damage me and I have all of the recipes synthesized. So what you want to do is you want to scroll down and well, you prob these will probably be like the only things you have unlocked right now. Uh, so what I'd want you to do is see the pebbled spear. It only costs two sprigs, three plant fiber, and one pebblet. And so when you've gotten all those resources, just click A on it and just equip it from your hot pouch, which you can by holding LB or whatever platform you're on. And then you'll have it equipped and now you can go and stab things. Now onto the pebbled axe. So what you need for the pebbled axe is crude rope. And in order to make this crude rope, you need to go to the material resources and scroll down until you find crude rope. That is also probably one of the only things you have unlocked. And then you can just craft one of them. It costs three plant fiber, by the way. You can find that stuff on the ground, like I showed you. And then you can go back here, and then scroll down, and then craft your pebble axe. By this time, by the way, you might need some more pebbles. I'd advise you to get some more because the pebble hammer requires more. Anyways, for the uh, pebble hammer, if you want to get a pebble hammer, you need four pebbles, three sprigs, and one crude rope. And so you can just do that, craft your crude rope, and then click A on this, and then make your pebble hammer. And with this pebble hammer, you can now access things like acorns, or even pebbles over here. Pebbles, or pebbles, I should say, will drop you a ton of pebbles for you to use in crafting and base building. Now lastly, for the spiky sprig, I don't really advise you guys to use this weapon, um, uh, but I will just kind of show you guys how to get it, because, you know. Now you don't need anything really specific, but what you do is you must find a plant with a purple flower on the top. It looks purple, and you can find them uh, anywhere on the map, kinda. There's, I don't know if you can see that, but there's one in the distance over there. But anyways, when you find one, they'll have these spiky leaves. And on the stem, you will find these things called thistle needles. And what you can do is you can just start collecting. And then, I'm pretty sure the spiky sprig costs five thistle needles. Um, but I just grabbed 10 because you can also use these for arrows for your bows and you are probably going to need to use a bow in the future. All right, now that we are back with our resources, we can go over to the workbench and go up. And for the spiky sprig, it requires three sprigs, five thistle needles, and two crude rope. So... You can just craft your crude rope with more plant fiber that you would find on the ground, and then you can craft it. Now this, the spiky sprig, it is a two-handed weapon, so it's gonna drain a little more stamina. Uh, I don't know where the heck the texture went. Um, I think it's kind of broken right now. But anyways, as you can see, the spiky sprig, I'm in awesome creative with bugs so my stamina doesn't go down. But when you craft the spiky sprig, uh, you'll have it. And I really don't know why this texture is broken. But anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching this short grounded tutorial. 
and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.